What's up guys, it's TechnoTuber and today I'm going to be reviewing the headphones JVC HAS600 which are right here. Let's go! Now before taking a look at the hardware, the design, let's take a look at the price first. The S600s cost only $50 on the JVC store online or about thirty to forty dollars on Amazon or eBay. This is a very good price but as we go through the video you will actually see that these should cost a lot more and that these ones are almost the best headphones for that price. Now let's take a look at the design. As we move here from the head panel towards the ear pads we can see that the design is very sleek and by the way I picked the white model as you can see from the ear pads. The S600s, as you can see here, are very flexible. You can open the ear pads just like this. As you can see, they're very soft so they don't hurt your ears. The wire is 1.2 meters long or 4 feet long. The bad thing about this is that the wire takes all the two slots and your friend won't be able to listen to the same music as you using the second jack as, for example, on the beat. Now let's see how flexible the head panel can get. As you can see here, it's very, very flexible in case if you have a big head or a small head. You can adjust it for both and you can even move the ear pads inside the earphones in case if they do it in your bag, uh, they won't break at all. And although there is absolutely no reason to do that, this actually represents how flexible these can get. And I must say that not only they are flexible, they are also very light and they are easy to transport. If you want to put this in your bag, you just need to put your ear pads just like this together and fold them in. As you can see, they don't take as much space as they would take um, unfolded. You can also roll the uh, wire around them so that it doesn't break or anything in your bag. Once you did that, you're done. Now here comes the moment where I should actually uh, demonstrate the sound quality of these. But as you're watching this video, you can't really hear what you would hear from the headphones. So the only thing I could show you is my reaction when I first um, actually listened to these. So here you go. My second reaction was to check my wallet and to realize that I only spent $50 and that it was a badass. Now let's take a look at what actually is happening in the specifications of these. Well the frequency response is very wide, it's from 8 Hz to 25 kHz. The sensitivity is 102 dB, which is not that loud but it feels very very loud in these headphones. The nominal impedance of these is 36 ohms, I'm not really sure what that means, if somebody could correct me that would be nice. The cord length, as I already mentioned it, it's 3.94 feet or 1.2 meters and it weighs just slightly more than an iPhone 4S. A thing I forgot to mention is that it's very cool to wear these uh, on your neck, uh, which is you just basically put them behind your neck, and uh, it's very, um, it doesn't feel like it's disturbing you. It's very simple, and uh, the only thing which could disturb you is the moving ear pads since they're very flexible and adjustable. So I guess for only $50 on the official store and even less on Amazon or eBay or other websites. I think you can't really go wrong with these ones. These are really good quality headphones. They're um, very flexible as you can see. I think these are also the best under $100 headphones out there right now in the market. There may be some better ones um, also made by JVC. I'm not sure about that but these are definitely very good. Only $50 seriously 10 times less than the Beats Pro. I really thank you guys for watching the video. Please leave your nice comments as you always do. If you have any questions also leave a comment um, and also catch me up on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus. All the links are always in the description. All I have to say now guys is enjoy your music. This has been the Techno Tour and up until next week. Peace.